here is an induction light bulb. I believe it's model 4340 to 23 watts. And according to this, it outputs 1400 lumens. 800 lumens approximately is what a traditional 60 watt light bulb is. So I believe this would be an equivalent of about a 100 watt light bulb somewhere in that range and the coloring is the 3500K which is cooler than I like for certain applications but there is some applications where that's fine what I really found interesting about this bulb is that it claims to last 54 years if you use 3 hours a day and that works out to be about 100,000 hours of operation which is really quite impressive so let's see if this bulb is any good. So here's the bulb itself. It's kind of large. Let me get a regular bulb here. It's about twice the size of a regular white bulb, but it's not outrageously large. There's plenty of fixtures I have that this will fit in with no problem. Alright, let's plug this in and see what it does. Okay, it does seem to do the work. Doesn't appear to flicker at all. It's moderately bright. Doesn't seem to me like it's 1400 lumens though. Maybe it needs to warm up. It's warm. It doesn't seem like it's getting any brighter. No, it's, I mean, it's pretty bright. It is illuminating the room relatively well. It's getting, it's not hot, but it is warm. It appears to be pretty much instant on. This stood less than a second of delay. So that's interesting. Um, hmm, okay. So not bad. That's a pretty decent quality light. It is a little bit cool though. It's, it's definitely not a nice warm color. I wouldn't use this necessarily in a bedroom. Although, certain lamps, if you had a nice warm colored lampshade, probably would be okay. So that's interesting. I think I'll buy a few more of these. It's pretty cool. And if they really do last 100,000 hours, that, that really is quite impressive. Here's the bulb in a lamp. This is a relatively small lamp, but it does fit. It's got about a quarter inch of clearance at the top been on for about an hour now. The glass is hot, but the ballast is still cool to the touch. Only slightly above ambient. So that's good. As far as the color temperature goes, you can tell it's not quite as warm as, as a 2700K bulb is. 
I think the camera is probably auto white balancing out the difference but it is a little bit cooler of a light now in a different lamp with a bigger shade a more yellow shade that wouldn't be as noticeable but even so this light is you know it's not flickery it's not obnoxiously cold it's not for a bedroom but it's quite satisfactory for plenty of applications around the house so I'm pretty happy with this bulb